I wouldn't normally bother you with this sort of thing, but, uh, well, I know I can trust you at this point. See, my personality is all based on this uh, pre-war cop fellow by the name of Nick Valentine. Guy volunteered to get his brain. Uh -huh. For as long as I can remember, I've been getting the memories of places I've never been. Things I've never seen. Memories of Nick's. They're not bad. They're just, um, they're just this inescapable reminder that I'm not the person I think I am. That I'm not a person at all. I'm just a machine, pretending to be human. Someone your age should be happy to have any memories at all, let alone a spare set. Heh, <laughs> I suppose so. But having to juggle my memories and all Nick's baggage makes things tough sometimes. Don't get me wrong, I know I'm in Nick's debt. These memories, they've, they've kept me alive. Nick was a hell of a cop, a guy with good instincts, and a good heart. I always counted myself lucky they didn't load me up with some ex-con or whatever type might volunteer to let folks tinker with their gray matter. But it's thanks to Nick that I pass for human. Why I get to live cushy in Diamond City and every other synth is shot on sight. I know I got it good, but my entire life I owe to Nick. Everything that makes me who I am, my judgment, my speech, hell, even my name, they're his. And I can't do a damn thing about it, because without them, without them, I'm nothing. A shell. All I want is a life where I have something I can call my own. We could give you a new name. Would that help? Ah, I got it. Crumblebot. 3,000. <laughs> well... I suppose it's the thought that counts. You know, I, I'm just gonna need some time to think on this. I appreciate you hearing me out. You're, you're a real good friend. Thanks. Now I've seen a lot of crazy stuff in my time. Toss out the troublemakers. Keep that in mind. Need a place to stay? Try Hotel Rexford. Hey, Charlie. I've heard some exterminator cleaned out the rats in the old warehouses. Wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Like an earth. Just doing my job. Always appreciate doing business with a professional. Better keep your iron strapped up. Friendly advice. Wild in the street, I got my mind blown. Stalking in a dream. The memory den's great. Just don't get hooked like old Kent. Poor bastard's practically stuck in the past. Can't believe it. He looked just like Sammy, too. Sure as hell didn't act like him. Institute thinks they... Fred, are you going to hang out in the lobby all day again, or are you actually going to go down and do some work? Being available to the customers is work. It's not all about cooking chems, Claire. It's not all about sampling those chems, either. 
Maybe if you stopped using, you could focus. What? Where's the fun in cooking it if you ain't using it? My mistake. Oh man, someone new! You need some jet, man? Home brewed? Reasonable prices? Not today. I'm always here if you need me. Before you even start, let's get to the point. We have rooms, one room specifically. Payment due up front. Deal. The room is on the top floor. When you come to the hallway, it's the last one on the right. Sanctuary Hills, right? Wait, are you from vault -Tec? I am vault -Tec. Twenty years of loyal service, and now look at me. I wasn't on the list. But you, look at you. Two hundred years, and you're still perfect. How? How's that possible? The vault had these pods that froze us in place. I only thawed out recently. What? vault -Tec never told me that. Unbelievable. Well, I had to get to the future the hard way. Living through the filth, the decay, and the bloodshed. Look at me. I'm a ghoul. A Freak. Don't take this the wrong way, but you were pretty ugly before. You know, you're the only other person I met from before. I, uh, I... Oh, God. I've been so alone here. No Commonwealth settlement once a ghoul with 200 years of vault tech sales experience. Hey, you know, you could head back to Sanctuary. I'll come visit. I promise. Really? You... you will? Okay. I'll head over there right now. You promise you'll come visit, right? I'll see you there. Don't worry. I'll get you up and running. Pretty distracting yourself. Hey there. You're new round good neighbor, if I'm not mistaken. What do you think of the place? Sticking around, you'll need to join the crew. I hear Bobby No Nos is looking. something spooky there's this old insane asylum up north a new player but in it ain't abandoned hello little pond like welcome to our fun and games 